and shifting focus now to music. If you haven't heard of Yelvis, that will soon change. The duo sound, what does the fox say, has so far had over 230 million views on YouTube, 44 times the population of Norway, their home country. And let's see what Yelvis has to say about their success with the quirky sound, the fox. The two Norwegian brothers who perform under the name of Ilvis have had great success with their parody pop song The Fox in the last couple of months. With over 230 million views on YouTube since its release in September, invitations to perform across the globe and a children's book based on the song, things seem to be going well for the duo. But in fact, it's not all milk and honey. The strange thing about this is that the people, uh, especially back in Norway, people now expect us to be like billionaires because of this and like uh, like people got back in the good old days when people sold records and uh, but the fact is always that we have like meetings every week now to sort sort of sit down look at the whole picture and ensure ourselves that we don't lose money on this project you know that that's how things are so um we should have been living like 50 years ago. Yeah. yeah. The song, which has captured the imagination of millions, asks the basic question, what does the fox say? What does the, fox say? the brothers appear in the video in a series of animal costumes, emulating the sounds of various animals, but are stumped when it comes to the red-furred creature. Ilva say that the book they're launching was organically developed from the theme of the song before they even made the video. First of all, we as we were supposed to make it like a tanked hit, we thought it would be funny to have like merchandise for something that didn't quite work out. That was a funny idea in itself. But we also felt that the the idea, what does the fox say, was a, was kind of a, it was a good idea for a, a children's book, no matter what we turned it into as a video. <laughs> The comedy duo already have their own show in Norway and they've performed at the iHeart Music Festival in Las Vegas, but they say they're still not famous. According to the pair, no one recognizes them without their costumes on. A case in point being their MTV EMA appearance in Amsterdam earlier this month. We were sitting there backstage during the show and there were people sitting around, you know, like bands, there are, they have this band attitude, you know, just looking like this. And we we were kind of uh, afraid, and then we put on the fox costumes, and things just turn around, and people come over and say, "Hey, I love your song." And so we're nothing more than fox, some costumes, actually. The book "What Does the Fox Say" will be published on the 12th of December in the UK and the US. Lee Maxwell Simpson, CCTV.